princess and goes bold in white wedding guest dress and sultry red lip in rare photos with husband Timothy. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. King Charles' sister stunned with her outfit for Lady Rose Windsor's wedding in 2008. Princess Anne's wardrobe is filled with casual raincoats for outings at her Gatcombe Park home and elegant coat dresses for her royal engagements, but she has ditched her usual outfits for a more daring look in the past. 2008. Returning to her style file, it is clear that the Princess Royal is not afraid to experiment with the looks of her wedding guests, an example being the wedding of Lady Rose Windsor and George Gilman. Instead of staying away from white, the only color usually reserved for the bride, and chose an ivory summer dress that reached her knees. In true 1960s style, it features a wrap bodice with ruffle trim and delicate jacquard polka dots with bridal color split with a feminine orange floral print. A pearl necklace, white shoes, and a clementine and lemon flower headdress with a bird cage. The hijab, tied with her dress perfectly. She was joined by her husband, Timothy Lawrence, who opted for a more classic look with his morning suit. Scientifically, white contains an equal balance of all colors of the spectrum, so it is natural that the main advantage of white is equality, neutrality and independence. Culturally, white is a symbol of purity, cleanliness, purity and perfection, which is why it is the natural color choice for wedding dresses and doctors' and sailors' coats. Previously, the late Queen Elizabeth II wore a cream, yellow spotted dress at the wedding of her son, Prince Charles, with his second wife, Camilla. The then Queen Camilla had chosen a blue and gold sequined wedding dress, so like her mother, Lau's choice of dress was not as surprising as you might assume. Meanwhile, the Princess of Wales wore a white Stella McCartney dress to Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's royal wedding in 2018. Traditionally, Guests avoid color to ensure they don't outshine the bride, but royal weddings have their own set of rules. Until around the 1940s, it was customary for your wedding party to wear white, a custom that many members of the royal family still practice. It is believed that the likes of Princess Kate chose snow-colored bridesmaid dresses due to the historical belief that white deterred evil spirits.